Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Deals, Deals and Meals, and this is Melissa. And today I have our weekly grocery haul for you. And I went to two stores this week. I know I don't always go to two stores. I know I said that last week. But there were a lot of good deals going on at Tops, and then I had to return some items at Walmart. So what I did was I returned those items and I used the credit and purchased many of these grocery items, which made it cheaper for me as well. Uh, so let's get started and I will show you what we got. So as some of you already know who have watched my grocery hauls before, you know that my daughter and I eat, um, she's vegetarian and sometimes vegan and I eat all vegan and my husband and my son um, will eat the vegetarian and vegan items at times and will also eat some meat. But this is a totally um, vegan and mostly vegan grocery haul with a few vegetarian items mixed in. Uh, so here we go. So when I went to Walmart, I always check their bread clearance. Uh, always check their bread clearance. I don't know if it's a particular day. I just haven't figured that out yet, but I just always go when I check out. Usually it's in the back, like near the dairy, but check out their uh, bakery clearance rack. And sometimes you can find some really great deals and you can freeze it. Um, so I lucked out today because they had several items. Uh, so I found these, these are like those sweet, the sweet Hawaiian rolls and they're the mini ones and it's their uh, Sam's Choice brand, and they were on sale for $1.40, and there's quite a few in here. And then I also found some uh, sub rolls, so these would be great for lunches for the kids and for my husband, uh, you know, now that we're back to school. And this, this was a six pack, and they're really large ones, I'm not sure if you can see, um, but this was only $1.00 two. And then I picked up some big loaves of French bread and Italian bread, and these were only 37 cents. And these are great, you know, for garlic bread, sandwiches, you can even slice it lengthwise, make pizzas. So um, I will probably pre-cut it and put it in the freezer and just keep it on hand for whenever is needed. And like I said, just absolutely couldn't pass up that deal. It is an awesome deal. Um, so like I said, definitely check out their clearance bread section anytime you're in there. And then I picked up some beans. We always like to keep beans in our pantry. So I got a big gigantic can of kidney beans, two cans of pinto beans. And then I picked up another package of these French fried onions. My daughter likes these when we do like salad night or baked potato night. She likes to add them to her meals for just a little extra crunch and flavor. And then I picked up a bottle of liquid smoke. We still have some on hand, but I uh, it was I think it was only like a dollar two I think for this bottle, which I think is a pretty really good a really good price. I usually order it online. Um, but anyway, I like to keep this on hand. We make a lot of um, like vegan bacon a lot of times, and we will use this. Uh, so like I said, picked up that one as well. They also it also comes in the hickory flavor, which I think is the one that we have currently. So I'm gonna try this mesquite one and see how that is. And then they have a huge um, like Asian Korean uh, section in Walmart now and I happen to walk by and they had a ton of clearance items. So I came across this and this is the, it's a 17 ounce, it's a soybean paste. So basically like, um, like a miso paste so you can make soups and stuff. Uh, so I thought this would be great to keep on hand to now that we're getting into the cooler, cooler months and we will be making lots of soups and I can use this as um, just an additional you know flavor into the different varieties of soups that we're going to make. And it was on clearance for $1.75, which is a really great deal. I think the original price was $4.99. So really great deal on that. And just picked up some extra Smart Balance butter. We still had some, but Walmart's the only place it really has it the cheapest. So I just figured while I was in there just to grab it and have it on hand. And then I picked up some Parmesan cheese. This is something we don't buy as often now that my daughter and I don't eat cheese anymore. Uh, but we are doing a pasta vizool night this week. Sorry, my hand is shaking. Um, we're doing pasta vizool week. Uh, pasta vizool is one of our freezer meals that I have, and we're going to be having that this week. So my husband and my son like to have cheese on it. So I picked this up for them, and this will last quite a while. It's an eight ounce container. And then I picked up a couple little, um, a couple beauty products as well. Some hair color. I had a coupon for this. I thought that was a really cool purpley color. I'm gonna try that out. I know these are not grocery items, but I just figured I would show you what my total, you know, my what my total um, haul was and what you know what I paid. 
And then I also found this, I usually order this online. This is the Schmitz Natural Deodorant, the Lavender and Sage. And I found this at Walmart and it actually is half the price that I usually spend when I order online. So really excited to find that. I think, believe it was only $4.72 and it's completely natural. Doesn't have all those, you know, bad harmful ingredients that are not, that are not good for us. Picked up a big gal, uh, gallon of white vinegar. I use this for my cleaning. This will last a while as well. I also use it to clean my fruits and veggies. And then I wasn't planning on purchasing, purchasing these and I just happened to walk by the like vegan, you know, meat and burger section and I happened to glance over and these had little peely uh, coupons on them, the Gardein. So they were actually $3.97, which is actually a pretty good deal for Gardein. But they had two dollar coupons, so I grabbed as many as I could find with the stick with the coupons, and so I got five bags. So I got two of the crispy green, um, the seven green crispy tenders, which are so good. We we love these. Great for you know, we put them on salads, pizza, you know, just on their own. Really great. Um, and then we got the crispy, the Mandarin orange crispy chicken. I figured these would be good to do like an Asian rice bowl night and throw those on top. And then we got the beefless. Uh, ground meat and this is really great too for you know like I've said before in many of my grocery hauls we love Mexican in this house so this will be a great uh, Mexican night and I could probably the whole family would most likely probably eat this so it'd be a great meal for everybody and then also I, we got one we've never seen these before so I figured we get them and try them out these are the sweet and sour porkless bites so we're, we're going to give those a try as well. I figure for two bucks, Miles will try it out and see how those are. And then one last thing I got at Walmart was this. I just happened to walk by the produce section just to see what was on sale. Um, like I've said before, we usually get our farm share every week. But I just happened to walk by just to see if there was anything that was a good deal. And they had this big bag of romaine lettuce and it was on sale for $2.38. And probably, probably going to eat this. Um, today or or tonight for you know with our lunch or dinner just because that was why they were marking it down because it's kind of start it'll be you know it's not going to last very long but I just figured it'd be a great um, quick meal okay so the second store that I went to was uh, I went to tops again I know I went there last week but I went again because uh, they were still running the same sale as last week so I wanted to pick up a few of those items again because it was such a great deal so I picked up another package of paper towels and these are really great. They're $3.99 and I, that it was the first time trying them last week and they um, hold up really well. And also they were still doing the quarter back sale, which when you purchase a tops item, you get 25 cents back. So I actually rang this all up in two transactions. So once I rang up the tops items, I got the coupon for each item, 25 cents back and rolled it over into the next order and used that coupon um, into my my items that were not from uh, not tops brand so anyway so I got the paper towels I picked up more of those eggs for my husband and son I picked up six dozen because they're only they were only 49 cents and these also were um, you got the 25 cents back as well and then we happened to go by like one of their little clearance uh, sections and they had this big bag of peanuts and like you know, if you're one of my regular viewers, my husband loves to eat peanuts on a daily basis as his snack. So we got these. Um, he'll have to, you know, take these out of the shell, but it was a really great deal. Uh, $2.70 for this big, gigantic bag. Um, and then we also found these. I know last week I had shown some few things that they had, um, pre you know, they had packaged up to... Uh, to sell for a cheaper price. So today we found some unsweetened coconut and it's a big, I don't know if you can tell, big container. And I'm going to use this, I use this a lot for making um, coconut bacon. So very excited about that. And that was another reason why I got, you know, the liquid smoke as well. And then we found some more of these little sesame crisp things. My daughter loves these as a snack. And this was a really good price as well. Oh, and the coconut was a dollar, let's see, a dollar three for this big container. And then these were a dollar sixty-five for those little sesame crisps. Then I also picked up some Tops uh, syrup. We're going to be doing 
a lot of uh, like some waffles and pancakes and French toast, especially because we have the eggs. Um, my daughter and I will make a I will make a vegan version for us. If you're interested in a recipe on that, a recipe video, leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, but so we needed some syrup, and then the kombucha Kavita kombucha was on sale. We absolutely love this stuff, especially the tart cherry is so good. Got three of those because they were on sale for two fifty plus it had a dollar coupon. No, dollar fifty coupon off when you purchase three. So I just couldn't beat that price because that is a really great price. They usually, you know, can be a little bit pricey. Um, so we picked them up when we can find them at a good price. And then the last two things from Tops was we just picked up uh, two more packages of the tofu because it was still on sale. I just wanted to keep it on hand since it was, it may not be for this week's dinners um, or meals, but I just figured let me just grab it because it was on sale and just to have it on hand. So that is everything for this week's haul. I know there is not a lot of produce because like I've said before, if you're familiar with my videos, we do also get a weekly farm share from our local farm. Uh, check out my Instagram page. I post usually post every week. I will post what, um, what we've gotten in uh, this week's share. So definitely check that out. We also have a lot of freezer meals currently and we have um, several things left over from the previous weeks. We're also trying to do the shelf timber, hashtag shelf timber. I don't know if you're familiar with that from uh, Jordan Page from uh, fun, funcheaperfree.com. Uh, she also has a YouTube page. Maybe I'll link it down below in case you, you know, want to check her out. She's so, she's so great. She always has a lot of great ideas, ideas on how to shop and uh, get, you know, how to shop for, you know, large families as well. Um, but anyway, she is doing a, deal, a thing right now with where you just use up the items that you have and just try to buy very minimal. I did purchase things this week that I may probably didn't need to buy, but they were really good prices. Um, and I also, like I said, I also have those few household um, and beauty products as well. Um, but all in all, like I said, I did, I returned, I actually returned a bunch of things at Walmart. So I got gift cards. So what I did was I used the gift cards for Wal at Walmart. And I only paid five dollars and eighty-seven cents out of pocket after my after the gift cards. That's even you know with getting the beauty products and household products. Um, and then for tops, my total was twenty-five dollars and eleven cents, which brings my whole total to for everything thirty dollars and ninety-eight cents. Um, and then uh, my household items were actually $18.25. So really, um, the food, the total for just the food, not to make this confusing, uh, but my total for just the food was only $12.73 out of pocket. So Jordan Page is doing this hashtag shelf timber, um, and she wants everybody to try to spend $25 or less. So I'm, I think I'm pretty good at, with what I've spent. And like I said, we do have a lot of food in our freezer ready to go and a lot of meals and even several of these items too are gonna get us through for several weeks. Um, so as always, I hope you enjoyed this grocery haul. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you are enjoying them. Um, if you're a new, some new viewer, don't forget to hit that red button and subscribe. And yes, those are my cats uh, fighting underneath my feet as I'm trying to record this if you hear them. Um, so anyways, um, until next time, um, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you soon. Bye.